Hey guys, so today we're going to show you how to connect the Profilux 4 to your Wi-Fi network using the static IP address method. The static IP address method is just one of three ways to get the P4 connected to your network. With this option, you get to assign a specific IP address to your device rather than having your network assign one for you. As we go through these steps, you'll see exactly what needs to be done so that you can wirelessly connect to your P4. To get started, connect each end of the included USB cable to the P4 and your PC. Once you've done that, select the Profilux 4 connection and click Connect. Once you are connected, click on the plus icon right beside System and select Communication. Set the Wi-Fi mode to Client and Access Point mode. Enter the exact name of your Wi-Fi network into the SSID box. Set the encryption to WPA WPA2 PSK. Enter your Wi-Fi network password into the Wi-Fi key box. Select Use following settings. Once you've done that, find the subnet mask and gateway by typing in CMD into the Windows search bar. Type in ipconfig and press enter. Look for subnet mask and default gateway and ignore everything else. Enter that information into the respective fields exactly as shown in your Windows command prompt. No need to make any changes to the DNS field. Type in the IP address you wish to assign to this device into the IP address field. Make sure that the first three fields match the first three fields of the gateway. The remaining field is where you assign a number within the DHCP range of your network. If you don't know this range, log into your router settings and get the information from there. Make sure that you don't assign a number which has already been assigned to another device. Otherwise, you will not be able to wirelessly connect to your P4. If you'd like to set up the P4's built-in Wi-Fi hotspot, you can do so here. To get this set up, simply give this hotspot a name and enter it into the SSID box. If you wish to set a password for this hotspot, enter it into the Wi-Fi key box. With those settings entered, go ahead and click Save Changes, then Disconnect. The P4 will now attempt to connect to your network. Wait about 20 to 30 seconds, then reconnect via USB. Once you are reconnected, go back to the communication settings page. The assigned IP address for this device will be listed here. Be sure to save this IP address because you will need it to wirelessly connect to your P4 via GCC or the app. You can always verify the Wi-Fi connection by using Windows Command Prompt to ping the IP address of the P4. To do that, simply reopen Windows Command Prompt and type in ping followed by the assigned IP address of the P4. Seeing this result with 4 packets sent and 4 received indicates that your P4 is successfully connected to your network. You will now be able to connect to your P4 over Wi-Fi using GCC. To do that, simply disconnect, click Administrator, click New, select the Profilux 4 device, give this new connection a name, and set this connection to Network. Once you've done that, you can either have GCC automatically search your network for the P4 or you can enter the assigned IP address of the P4 into the host name box. With that done, click Save, close out this window, select the newly made connection, and click Connect. Thanks guys for watching this video. 
Subscribe to our channel to get updates on new tutorial videos. If you'd like to see certain how-to videos, let us know in the comments section below. If you have any questions for us and need further support, you can always reach out to us on our GHL support forum or by email at info at